Hey, y'all. So I'm back with some more birthday goodies. Um, yesterday, we were gone all day. And we were at our friends doing the whole holiday barbecue games and firework thing. Um, played some volleyball. Had a real good time. Always good when we get with them folks. We all, we've been a crew for a long time now since we were all kids. So um, the fireworks were awesome. Our fellas did a awesome job. Um, I put some pictures and I went live last night on Instagram and I took a few pictures and posted up on my Instagram if you want to check that out. But the live video that I was doing on Instagram last night of all of our fireworks, I uploaded it to the YouTube channel. So if you like fireworks and you want to check them out, go see the video I posted of the fireworks show we did last night. And then we came home and it was really, really late. And I had this lovely package sitting at the door with another package and I popped it open as you see just to peek inside and be like yep that's what I thought it would be and then we were taking care of critters and going to bed because it was late and we were wore out it had been a long day good day long day so I want to get into this this is the other package that was on top I'm going to set this aside Now, before I show you what's in the box, I'm going to show you something else. Um, I had some other birthday goodies that I did not, and I'm pulling the picture up on my phone just a second. I had some other goodies that I did not share um, just because they were like clothes and stuff like that. So, but this one gift I do want to share. It's non-coloring related, but... I don't care on a show. So my dad came over my birthday morning. He brought me a big, huge pan of homemade goulash that he made. It was still hot out of the oven. Uh, and he did a cake for me. He even brought the candles. And he had this as a present. Hopefully we see without that glare too much. And it's not glared on my phone. I'm trying to figure it out. Anyway, so this is a rocking chair, an older one that he had gotten me at an auction. Uh, I don't know, a month or two prior, he said. So before he ended up getting sick and going to the hospital and stuff. So he got this chair for me and he took a, I guess, a big lighter and maybe his pocket knife or something. And he put this on the bottom. Oh, it's going to show. I don't know why there's such a glare. There we go. That's better. So it just says, happy birthday or happy B-Day 2021. Love, Dad. And I just love that. I love the chair. It works in because I like older stuff and he knows it. So, yeah. So I have this rocking chair from my dad. And... Like I said, it's it's special to me. So, that was another thing. So, let's get into this. In this Prime package came one simple thing. But I was very happy to have it. Voila. The uh, colorless Tombow brush tip. Or is that a felt tip? Marker. And we got a pointy part on this end. Feels quite dry. I guess I'm going to, I should be priming it, obviously, I'm sure. But I will figure that out. But I have heard and seen these are used a lot for like ink tints and such. And so I was like, oh, I want to give that a whirl. And then I also seen um, another color tuber 
put some different solution in here once it was emptied out and using it uh, still as a colorless blender. So I got me one of those to try. And, you know, I think I showed maybe in a flip. I'm not sure. I did have a package come right after I made my first video and it had this in it. And it was the, it's the Desert Storm um, tanned paper. So I got a small pack of that to try out. Um, came highly recommended. So I'm going to give that a whirl. And then another item that I have gotten is in this suspicious little black bag. I can rip into it. There we go. Maybe. I thought I had it. It is very well wrapped. Several, several rolls around itself there. Comes. Okay. We're getting closer. I got these. So these, again, were highly recommended um, for use with Oh, sorry about all the noise. Just rip it. Noisy paper. So, yes, these are varying sizes of the stencil brushes. Um, and these came highly recommended from the Karen Valentine um, channel. I'll have to link her below already have in another video recently uh yeah so this is one of her favorites to use with gelatos and like items um maybe even her neo twos possibly can't remember gelatos for sure um so just for smooshing and whooshing around which i also have the 11 piece brush set like this so I have these and these also now, which I'm sure I'm going to like both and I'll probably end up getting another set of these. But I'm super happy to have those since if you've seen the other video, you will know that I have some goodies to use these with. So I got those. And then like I mentioned in the other uh, birthday haul video I did, this is in its own plastic too. When I find an artist or a series of books or something that I really like, I like to get the whole set because I am whole set syndrome series. So another book that I got is this one, the uh, Forest Girls 3. And so obviously I have one and two and I wanted to get this one. I want to see cover without the flap. Love that. Silver foiling on there. Even like this. Nice print. So you may be familiar, in case you're not, a little peeky poo. I might do a book flip of all three of these books together, possibly. But it's this little girl and her little doggy that we are all familiar with now through this book series. Super sweet and cute. So there's one, two, and three, and one of them is even a hardback book. I wish they were all hardback books, honestly. I just, I don't know, I love that. So Forest Girls 3. And hopefully she'll come out with some more. And then... In my box, here comes the train, choo-choo. I got the King Arts. Super excited about these. And so I got the 48 colors. And then I also have the 24 pastel pack. Because, you know, got to have them all, right? 
so I haven't even gotten any of these, and I'm like really excited about it. Um, Shannon from Shannon Chop and Hayes channel, who I'll link her also. Her and Karen. Um, she did a really great video on these. Uh, comparison. Play around with these and some gelatos. And she's a fan of these and those, of course. And she get these four cases, which is cool. And I think these are going to be an item that I I'll keep in their little cases. They look like that. I like the whole setup of them and their little comfort grip. Not that I'll be using them like that, but it's weird texture. Definitely want to play with these. I may even do a swatch video for these. I'm not sure. To my knowledge, these are all the colors that they make for these. And this is actually a quite affordable um, set. And so even though they're kind of like their own thing, they they fall into the category of Neo 2s and Gelatos just in the sense of the application styles and just, you know, how you use them and play with them um, as far as preferably and then you could do it a few different ways but like the, the preferred way seems to be to you know to smear those things out on, on a separate palette and pick it up from there either picking it up and applying it dry or picking it up and applying it wet um, either way they both still have that similar function ability at least um, I'm sure there's you know many other ways to use them and stuff that's just how I will mostly be using them and mostly see those types of items being used. But they are their own critter in and of themselves. Um, so you can't really compare them to any of those things other than similar style of application, I guess is the best way to put it from what I know of them. Um, but I definitely trust my information sources. These will get the pastel guys out Let's see what's I just have to decide if I'm going to slip these things back in their boxes or am I going to ditch the boxes and put these in something else maybe maybe not maybe I just have them loose I don't know Decisions, decisions, people. But now, like, even with the um, gelatos that I got, the, the packaging it came in, this little area, I cut that off, and I put that in the little zippy bag that I have <clears throat> deemed their home. Backs like that, too. Yes. Schmear. Right there. Um, trying to think. So those are the colors you get in the pastel set, and they are different from the colors you get in that. So yeah. So there's some of my more more of my birthday goodies. I have one birthday item, at least coloring related. Like I said, I did get some. Um, Cole's gift cards and things and so that was for like you know clothes and shoes and that stuff will be coming but as far as coloring related I have one more thing and I will say it is a book and so I have one more book coming and that will complete the um, birthday haul goodies for 2021 but I am super grateful and super happy and I wanted to share these things and share my birthday hauls because I love watching those videos myself. Any kind of haul video, honestly. 
Um, I love watching the halls and what you got in your bags and share your collection and room tour and how you store your stash. And I like seeing all that because one, I like seeing how other people are, you know, storing and keeping and organizing as well as what, a, what you got. I won't be nosy and see what you got and uh, collect ideas because some of my best stuff has come from watching other people's haul and collection videos. And so I have discovered books or artists or maybe a supply that I was unaware of and very much appreciate getting because I had seen it somewhere else. And so, yeah, that's why I wanted to do these videos and will continue to do the videos because I like watching them. And I just think they're fun to get ideas and see goodies. And it's fun. So why not? So now that I've said all that, blah, 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 I am going to wrap it up. And when that one book comes, I'm not going to do a video, like I said, but I'm going to do a flip for that specific book. So I will just pop up the video and I will mention this is the book, the, the last thing standing from my birthday goodie batch and do a book flip of it. And so that's going to be it. Hit that thumbs up, comment down below. Let me know what you think about these goodies. If you have any of them, use them, how you use them. If you've never seen them before and your interest is peaked, um, welcome to the train. It makes several stops in the coloring world jump on wherever you feel froggy and subscribe and hit that bell because there's always more to come. Till next time. Later, y'all.